So the just two news in this press tour. One, it's about the image with which we wanted to capture the spirit and the atmosphere and the scope of the Biennale. And the second one is uh, invited practitioners that we wanted to share their experience and knowledge about the theme. So regarding the image, it's uh, Bruce Chadwin traveling through South America that encountered uh, this old lady walking the desert with an aluminum stair on her shoulder. It was uh, the German archaeologist Maria Reiche uh, studying the Nazca lines. For those of us standing on the ground, looking at the desert is just stones, it's random gravel. But from the height of the stair, this woman found a new point of view, a new perspective from where stones became birds, flowers, trees. So in reality, for many of us standing on the ground doesn't make any sense. There are some people that have found the way to make sense out of it. And we would like the Biennale to be that. Identify those that have found a new point of view from where reality makes sense and share with all of us standing on the ground the experience, the knowledge, eventually the, the threats and challenges that they see from this new acquired point of view. There is something very, if we keep on digging into the image, <clears throat> One could have thought uh, that, well, why a stair? Well, she didn't have any money to rent a plane, nor had the technology for having a drone to looking at those lines. And yet, with a very modest instrument, an aluminum stair, she was able to find this new point of view. So I guess that from then, that point on, there are no excuses because of the scarcity of means or the difficulty of the circumstances within which you have to operate not to go where you want to arrive. It's, it's, a, it's a very important lesson about the capacity and the creativity being applied not only to the project or the solution but even to the tools, to the understanding of the procedures that are required to deliver quality of life. But if we keep on digging, even if she had the money to rent a truck she may have had uh, or a car and eventually would have been faster to to drive ar around the desert and then go on the roof of the car and and look at that uh, those stones she would have destroyed what she was trying to study so there's a certain precision and a certain pertinence in choosing the right tool on the one hand do not uh, blame it on the difficulty not to, to do, what, to make a contribution, but also do not consider that you, you take for granted that the resources that you have at hand may solve the solution. You still need to be strategic and smart to identify what is the right procedure. And all of this somehow is what we wanted the Biennale to be, what people while going there may get from those that have, have acquired this uh, new point of view.